Hi, welcome to True Diagnostic. My name is Tavis Mendez and I am the lab director for True Diagnostic and I am excited to show you our 5,000 square foot facility where we will find your true age. So the sample process starts here in intake where each sample is received and then we'll scan each sample into our proprietary limb system. What this proprietary limb system that we have developed in-house will do, it will de-identify each sample and give each individual a unique barcode. We not only process true diagnostic samples, we also uh, process various research samples as well. So here in the pre-amplification room, we begin with DNA extraction. And the protocol that we use is the established mini prep technique. And in this technique, we take the red blood cells and we disrupt the cells themselves. And we put it into a column, which will actually grab onto the DNA and allow us to wash through the DNA itself and give us a pure prep for DNA quantification. In the DNA quantification step, we'll be using the TCAN Infinite M Nano. What this machine does is it reads fluorescence from the sample itself. And how this works is that we take the DNA sample and we bind it with a fluorescent marker and we put it into this machine. This machine will read the fluorescence and we'll be able to compare it to a known standard, which would then give us an exact concentration of the sample that we are working with. The next step is bisulfite conversion. And bisulfite conversion is the gold standard by which DNA methylation is analyzed. And how this protocol works is that we begin looking at the methylated cytosines and non-methylated cytosines. The protocol takes away the non-methylated cytosines and replaces them with urea cells, allowing only the methylated sites to be scanned more efficiently. And how this process works is that we use this thermal cycler machine here. And this machine allows the temperature to go up and down very smoothly for the conversion process to work very efficiently. Now, despite the fact that this is the gold standard by which DNA methylation is an analyzed, we're always looking to the future to look at better ways to do these the analysis and give you a better product. After the pre-amplification room, the samples are now transferred to the post-amplification room, where the DNA samples will be amplified, fragmented, and hybridized onto the HD Illumina bead chips that have eight wells that contain pre-probed oligos that will bind to the target DNA, which then will be put into the hybridization chamber for the DNA, the DNA to completely hybridize to the oligos themselves. What we have here is the TCAM Freedom Evos. These are automation machines that allow us to make the process that we use for extending and staining the bead chips more efficient and smooth. These machines themselves are very unique as they will automate this part of the process because this part of the process is one of the most important. Any aspect of the staining and the extension if it is disturbed, it will destroy the entire experiment. This experiment takes place in this T-flow chamber here, and with this automation machine, it will allow us to potentially process up to 2,000 samples a week. So here, we have the eye scan machine. This is the state-of-the-art aluminum machine that will scan the actual bead chips for the DNA methylation sites. As you can see here, we have yellow tape, a caution tape, because this is the most sensitive piece of equipment that we have. This particular machine uses a dual color metric detection system to allow us to detect those methylation sites. And it can actually, uh, using the system that we use right now, we can detect up to 850,000 sites. This is the auto loader, and what this will allow us to do, it will also automate the actual scanning process as well. If you were to do it manually, you'll have to manually put four bead chips into the machine and work with the computer program. But when you add the auto loader here, you can have several stacks of these four bead chips, and it will automatically load each stack into the machine for you, which will obviously make the process more efficient. <music> 